Hi everybody, welcome to Honey Bee Honey. It is now uh, fall, about mid-fall, a month and a half away from winter. And I wanted to show you, uh, with this hive in the background here, I'll show you an up-close view here. It's actually pretty cold out right now. We're looking at about 43 degrees, something like that, but it's warm enough where there's a couple bees flying. You see there's not much activity. There's a bee on this side. But to, to keep my videos uh, streaming and stuff, I did take some video earlier in the year of a hive that was washboarding. Washboarding is a pretty interesting little movement by bees, and not everybody understands it. In fact, actually nobody for sure understands it as far as I know yet. So let me uh, switch over to a, a, a different video, and I'll show you some washboarding movement on these hives that were right in my backyard here. So washboard movement is a pretty unique thing that bees do, and you see it pretty often if you have bees, but you can see them moving back and forth with their head on the uh, landing board there. Front legs kind of scraping, everything else kind of scraping, and they're just moving back and forth and back and forth. And I have, there are better videos of this on YouTube. This is a second hive here. Uh, you see that movement back and forth by that bee right in the center, kind of at the bottom of the screen? That's washboard movement. First off, let me tell you that no one really knows why bees do this. I'm just showing you the behavior because it's really unique behavior. Possible explanations are they're propolizing the door, they're cleaning the door. Uh, they're, in some older bee books, you'll see that beekeepers think there's nothing else to do, so they're just doing this. And the reason they think that is because this often happens, at least in my observance and in the books that I've read as well, this often happens at the close of the season when there's really no nectar coming in or the nectar flow is really falling off. In 1975, The Hive and the Honeybee, written by Sons, came out. And I'm reading from that version where it says that these rocking movements probably serve as a mechanical cleaning process by which the bees scrape and polish the surfaces of the hive. Usually this scrubbing dance, both inside and outside the hive, is performed by young bees. In describing washboard behavior, what they call it in ABC and XYZ of bee culture, the 1990 edition, it says that it will be seen that the entrances to colonies are polished by bees. This is especially clear on trees. No one has been able to document why bees behave in this manner, but we have assumed that this smoothing of the entrance surface serves to eliminate cracks and crevices where noxious microbes might live just as polishing the inside of the nest with propolis gives protection there. So no one really knows why bees do this. The consensus seems to be that, they, that they're engaged in some type of cleaning activity, which it certainly looks like they're doing. Uh, if I had to guess, I would say that it is actually a honeybee dance, one that we've not... We may have identified it as a dance because some books do refer to it as a dance. However, nobody knows what the dance means, and some beekeepers have observed this inside the hive as well. I haven't really observe that in my hives, but it's, it's probably in there, I just haven't noticed it. Uh, these are some, these are my own hives of course, and the link below I put a video from Dr. James Tu, who writes in uh, Bee Culture Magazine, and he has a video online, and again the link is below, that shows an extreme amount of washboarding, it's a really beautiful video, so if you have an extra minute, while I rolled my credits, I also played the washboard video again, so Thanks for your support. We'll see you next time.